have you had a problem of you wanted to take your animal to the veterinarian and every time you go there they manage to build up the price to give you a bill of like you know hundred dollars two hundred dollars three hundred dollars and up and all you went for was one little thing you know and then they start with oh we should really do a lab test and this and that okay so I, I found one of these places online I'm very grateful for that they meet you in a public parking lot and you know there's a line of people there with their animals and you're out in the fresh air and the dog isn't afraid because he's not in some weird smelling you know office with you know chemicals and medicines and, and, and you know he's out in the open he's under a tree he's with dog lovers he's with other dogs so it's it's totally relaxing for the dog he's not nervous he's very cooperative and they give you the rabies shot and they don't just, you know, give it to anyone. They look at the dog. They actually weigh the dog. They give you an opinion about the dog. If you ask a question, they go ahead and, you know, touch the dog and ex examine them. So, I mean, I got an exam and a weight and evaluation, and, and there was no rush. I could ask as many questions as I wanted, and the, the veterinarian was very kind. And, I mean, it was just a wonder, wonderful experience. And what did I pay? Twenty-seven dollars. So he got his his yearly rabies shot. They um they send you an email of everything they did and all the details, their signatures, their veterans um the veterinarian's uh, official you know medical number, license, all that. And all you do is you know you print it up and you send it to your county animal services and they uh, send you the license. And uh, this place I went to, um, they also gave you a tag. They gave you a rabies tag. So um, it's it's wonderful that some things in modern life are wonderful like this. So don't be afraid to do something different. And um, you know we got to survive, and we can't waste money. It's uh, money's very easy to spend and very hard to earn. I am um, remembering when I uh, said to my neighbor because he was complaining about you know being in debt and I said well maybe it's time to go extreme frugal and he said oh well, I'm already frugal no I said really extreme like you buy a big bag of cornmeal a big bag of beans and a big bag of rice and that's it and he said why should I put myself through all that but that's just silly, you know, it happens to you if you eat, you know, basic, uh, healthy food. Uh, you get healthier, you feel good. I mean, think of the alternative when you're not eating healthy and you have all these doctor visits and, and all these medications and surgical procedures, etc., etc. Think about everything.